Monday morning at 10 o'clock, and we got a review for you. Uh, yes, sir. It's been a while. I know. We're getting back into it. So we got some assassinato tequila out of Pensacola, crafted in Mexico. There so we it's go. musician owned and operated. That I love. Corey Williams and Danny Warsnop of Aston Alexandria started the company out. Here you go, sir. So this is their Blanco expression. Let's check it out and see what it's like. Beautiful smell on it. That's some good stuff. Right? Yeah. It's good. smooth, but it's tequila. But it's good. It's, and it's added to free, too. So you got all the nasty oh, shit, like old Casamigos and some of those. Didn't mean to say that, Casamigo. Sorry, I love y'all. But <laughs> this is just added to free. This is good stuff. Yeah. You can really taste the fruity notes, a little peppery finish. The cave really shines through with it. So you're a tequila guy. So you know all these notes and all? It's just good tasting. Shit to me. I can't pick up everything. I am a tequila snob, but this is really good. Though. Yeah. So how'd you learn about this? So this is from Danny Warsnop, Ashton Alexander, one of my favorite bands. He started this company. I started following him. And for probably two years, I've been trying to shoot Corey message, trying to get him like we wanted in Alabama. For my restaurant, for your restaurant here at Sanctuary. Yeah. So I just kept sending messages and finally got up with Corey and we're act actively trying to get this in Alabama for you booze bags. Nice. And for us. So anything y'all can do, like uh, just watch and like and share. Share it right. out, get the word out. This this is, their website is thebesttequilaever.com, I believe. And this, I mean, it really there is. You go. We have over almost 300 tequilas at Alpinos and this is one of my favorites that needs to be in Alpinos and in the state of Alabama. I agree. So the second one we got is the Reposado. There you see. So this one is this one's really gonna surprise you. Real sweet nose, kind of mm -hmm. caramelly, smooth texture. <laughs> that's good shit, isn't it? dude. That's like <laughs> drinking candy. There it is. That is dangerous. So I believe they age it in Jack Daniel's barrels. Okay. Corey can, you know, fix that if it's wrong. But man, it's just like caramel. It is. Like it's like butterscotch almost. Drink. Yeah. I mean, it is truly like a candy it's almost. It's real velvety mouthfeel. Yeah. I mean, oh, that, that's amazing, dude. That needs to be in Alabama. Yeah. I mean, we're drinking it just straight up Monday morning, 10 o'clock. Putting cocktails, <laughs> margaritas, chilled, everything. And they also have a Cristalino and Yeho version, which we don't have here, but that one's also fantastic. I tasted it before with Danny, one of his tequila tastings. Good stuff. Nice. So what do you rate them at? Hey, that's two thumbs up for me on both of them, and I'm not the hugest tequila guy. I'm growing on you, though. It is. That's right here. Hi. Look at him. Look at him go. Mm. Two thumbs up. Love it. 